If you want your children to be intelligent, read them fairy tales. If you want them to be more intelligent, read them more fairy tales. There are only two ways to live your life. One is as though nothing is a miracle. The other is as though everything is a miracle. The most beautiful experience we can have is the mysterious. It is the fundamental emotion that stands at the cradle of true art and true science. Whoever is careless with the truth in small matters cannot be trusted with important matters. It would be possible to describe everything scientifically, but it would make no sense, it would be without meaning, as if you described a Beethoven symphony as a variation of wave pressure. The world is a dangerous place to live, not because of the people who are evil, but because of the people who don't do anything about it. We all know that light travels faster than sound. That's why certain people appear bright until you hear them speak. The important thing is not to stop questioning. Curiosity has its own reason for existence. One cannot help but be in awe when he contemplates the mysteries of eternity, of life, of the marvelous structure of reality. It is enough if one tries merely to comprehend a little of this mystery each day. The pursuit of truth and beauty is a sphere of activity in which we are permitted to remain children all our lives. Once you can accept the universe as matter expanding into nothing that is something, wearing stripes with plaid comes easy. You never fail until you stop trying. I am enough of an artist to draw freely upon my imagination. Imagination is more important than knowledge. If A is a success in life, then A equals X plus Y plus Z. Work is X, Y is play, and Z is keeping your mouth shut. Imagination is everything. It is the preview of life's coming attractions. The world as we have created it is a process of our thinking. It cannot be changed without changing our thinking. Two things are infinite, the universe and human stupidity, and I'm not sure about the universe. When you are courting a nice girl an hour seems like a second. When you sit on a red hot cinder a second seems like an hour. That's relativity. I speak to everyone in the same way, whether he is the garbage man or the president of the university. Any fool can know. The point is to understand.